Hi everyone, this is Quinn from Power Admin. Today we're going to add a disk space monitor to a server that we're monitoring. So let's right click on the monitor and say add new monitor. Then we're going to select disk space monitor and say OK. At this point you'll get a menu that will appear and will list all of the drives that it has found on that server. Just so that you know, uh, for non-Windows servers, it will try to find the drives using SNMP as well. So if this is a non-Windows machine, make sure that you've added your SNMP credentials. We're going to go ahead and select the C drive on this machine and say OK. Then we're going to set the thresholds that we want for this. And in this case, I want to go with 200 megabytes as a threshold and say OK. At this point, you'll see the disk space monitor appear, and if we had multiple disks, you would see multiple disks listed here. If you wanted to edit any of them, you'd go ahead and select the drive, click on Edit, and you'll see the thresholds and the alias come up that you can edit. If you wanted to remove, simply select and click on the Remove button, and those would be removed. A few other settings that you can see on this monitor are at the bottom, the radio buttons there. If new drives appear on this machine, uh, these options will tell the, mon the monitor what to do. If we need to add the new mon uh, disk drives to this monitor or not add the new disk drives. At this point, we're going to go ahead and uh, add our actions and change the schedule. By default, the disk space monitor is six, every six hours it's monitored. We're going to leave it at the default time. And then this is done. So all we need to do is click on OK, and the monitor will be added to our server. Thank you, and have a great day.